man with a plan. Living Rosters has been a part of NBA 2K for a really long time. It's been able to provide users with a fairly up-to-date roster in terms of ratings and, uh, and player movements over the, over the last few years. Uh, but we really felt like it had a few limitations, uh, namely how quickly users were able to get those roster updates and uh, the trends that players were going through in real life were not necessarily reflected very well in our old Living Roster system. So we teamed up with a company called Stats Inc. Um, they're a very innovative um, stats information company and combined we came up with a feature called Dynamic Living Rosters. Dynamic Living Rosters is actually going to allow us to alleviate a lot of those limitations we had before. Uh, people are going to be getting their roster updates a lot quicker and they're also going to start to notice the trends that players are going through. So if a few players in, in real life are going, going off, you're going to notice that in the game and, and the vice versa. If a few players are going cold, you're going to notice that as well. And it's not something that's uh, tailored towards you know, the big name players or the big name teams. Every player, every team in the game is going to be living through this system and they're going to be reflected in the game. We're really excited to bring you Dynamic Living Rosters powered by Stats Inc. Uh, we really feel like it's going to change the way that you play the game. And there it is. One of the most requested features outside of Cruise was for us to take it to the next level with what we do with our roster updates. Right, Chris? And of course, that was a big thing with the community, right? Calling for the NBA 2K Insider's head half the time. Yeah. But he was actually really instrumental. We had a lot of good conversations, Ronnie and myself, with the devs, with the team, and they really wanted to give you guys the best roster updates that the series has ever seen. And this year, you're going to have it. Yeah, uh, it's going to be updated in real time. Um, it's really about taking it to the next level in terms of if a guy is hot and has been playing that way for a while, it's not going to just be reliant on the insider, it's also going to be reliant on a formula and so we can really measure whether somebody is playing to the maximum of their capabilities. It's more about giving a rating a range as opposed to just that one number, you know what I mean? Absolutely, and of course powered by Stats Inc. So we're going to be able to uh, take the take the stats use right that from the source. Yeah the, yeah, the statistical data that we're, we're the devs are able to pull in this year is going to really just make the game feel more alive than ever before. So hey, it's Sasha, you're be always great. telling me that the uh, the game is always taken to another level every single year. What do you think about this? Absolutely. Well, I think this brings another dynamic into the game, definitely. Like, stats are going to be updated, I guess, more often. Yeah. And that's going to be really great because then you're watching a game, you're seeing your favorite player and how he plays and how you said he may be on a hot streak. Maybe not so much, but yeah. you're going to see that as well in the game. Yeah. So that's going to be interesting to see how that plays out. And, yep. and as Zach alluded to, it's not just going to be for the big market teams, which I think sometimes is a perception that... I, uh, they would be Glad the Knicks and the up, Lakers. Yeah. It's going to be every team. So if you're a fan of the Raptors or you're a fan of the, the Grizzlies, the Lakers, the Knicks, the Miami Heat, it doesn't matter. Every team is going to get the same love and fed the same amount of information from Stats Inc. to really give you guys the most up-to-date, dynamic living rosters. Yeah, I, th I felt like, and I think the reason that this happened more than anything was fan feedback, you know? like Yes. I felt like that was a, one of our most glaring weaknesses on, on 13. Yes. And we needed to shore it up. We needed to make it make sure that it was it was taken to that next level. And uh, I'm really glad that we were able to work with the dev team to get that to happen this year. It was something that just needed to. Absolutely. And you know, Ronnie and I are here. You guys know you can hit us up, yell at us, love us. I get tweeted a lot. <laughs> uh, but you know, we, it's uh, it's amazing. We're always listening, and yes. we're always talking to the devs. There's probably nobody. Those guys are so annoyed with me. I'm in their office like, I might as well just sleep there. It's full, it's full throttle. We are here to listen to our community and provide the best NBA 2K experience for you. And NBA 2K14, from the gameplay changes to dynamic living rosters to the new things like signature skills, which we talked about earlier yep. in PAX, the game is absolute fire. And we are under a month away yep. from getting it in everybody's hands, and I cannot wait. We'll talk more about gameplay. We'll talk about more about my team, which we haven't really gotten my into. Mm -hmm. And honestly, my team is one of probably the most 
popular features out of last year. Outside of my player, my team was probably the most played mode. Um, so we have a lot more info on that because my team is, we're taking it. And there is a player. lot yeah. of new stuff in my team. The devs yep. are going to break it down. You're going to see some footage of some of that stuff. But for now, we're going to kind of play the waiting game. Now, of course. That's all I do. I'm just the hype machine. The hype machine, <laughs> getting signing autographs with chicks. It's a rough life for me, TK. Yeah, it, it but, uh, rough, you know, we've, we've, we've made so much progress over the years, and I'm really excited for this year with NBA 2K14. The team could have easily just said, roster update, 2K14, moved on to next gen. But current gen, NBA 2K14, is the, I'm going to go on record, the best NBA 2K game the series has ever seen by leaps and miles it is unbelievable and i can't wait to share some of that this friday when i beat ronnie 2k using my lakers and kobe bryant year this is siri thank you for watching and be sure to like this video for more videos from this particular mode click more videos if you want to see more content from ikc click subscribe oh and don't forget to follow ikc on twitter and to like his facebook page this is siri signing out peace